In this module, we will review remote control capabilities, identify the resources to prep the customer environment, and review configuration, connection, and locking settings for remote control. Enable and Central delivers the ability to remotely control any managed device in your network. This allows technicians to troubleshoot and resolve issues remotely without interrupting the customer. Enable and Central provides multiple options to access devices by remote control. Remote control operations vary based on the operating system and remote control type. Preparation of the customer environment is required to implement remote control. The following resources are available for the various remote control sets. Take Control, Remote Desktop, SSH, Team Viewer, or a custom solution. Remote control connections depend on the OS for client and target devices. The following table outlines the OS and compatibility with various remote control types. Any Windows or Mac OS device under active management can be controlled by an agent or probe remotely. Probes are required to be in the same domain as the device that you want to remotely control. The target device needs an agent installed. Before remotely connecting to a device, that device must be configured for a remote connection. If this is the first time connecting remotely to the device, Enable and Central will prompt you to download the control client to the device. The Lock Remote Control setting prevents changes to how technicians connect to devices remotely. It is important to remember. Locking your remote control setting is hierarchical. A high-level locked account cannot be unlocked by a lower-level account. A default administrator can unlock a setting that was locked by a customer admin.